All right, hey guys, welcome back to another one. Uh, we are going to No Start Bash today. Uh, got the family with me. Hi. First time uh, Kai's going on an out of town drift trip with us, so that's gonna be fun. But uh, we got Frank with me. We're just waiting on um, we're just waiting on Micah to pull up, and then we're gonna be on our way. My car is actually getting trailered down by the homie AJ. Appreciate that, bro. Uh, so we're gonna catch up with him whenever we get to the Airbnb. All right, well, we're a little more than about halfway to uh, Ohio now. So we just had to stop, put some fuel in uh, all the vehicles, get some sodas, use the bathroom and all that jazz. And then uh, we'll get back on the road and we should be there in about two hours. I think we're gonna arrive right around 7.40ish PM. So uh, hopefully it's still a little bit of uh, daylight yet uh, left and uh, show you guys around the Airbnb before we uh, call it a night. All right, well, we're at the Airbnb. We've been here for a while. We actually are just getting settled. We went to uh, the grocery store, got a little bit of food to uh, hold us over, uh, and some supplies for the cars and whatnot. Right now, Micah is under the Mustang getting uh, his bumper all together. He just got done. What, what, did you, what all did you do to your car? What's up? What all did you just do to your car? You did the fuel filter? Fuel filter, the bumper, and that's it for now. Just kind of getting the alignment done. Yep. And then you said you got to put the front bumper together in the morning? Yes. And then Frank, I think Frank's good. Yeah, for now. For now, he just had to change a headlight in the truck. Yeah. All good. And uh, I'm just waiting on AJ and uh, Campbell to actually get here. Uh, AJ, like I said, is a uh, trailer with my car down. So when my car gets here, I'm probably not going to touch it until in the morning. That's whenever I'm going to... Probably just show some attention to my front fender, but besides that, the car is ready to go. So uh, I'm going to show you guys actually a little bit of the Airbnb, and then uh, you guys should see what's going on in the morning. Yep. All right, and I got uh, Kai with me here. He's going to help uh, show you guys around, right? Yep. All right. What do we got here? First little living room area. Got yeah. Corey. Got mom sitting on the couch. Really nice. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little area over there with the Xbox. What we got out there, Kai? Um, we have a little... Patio area. Uh, All right, walk me around. Show me where we're going. Um, what else we got? We have a fridge, of course. <laughs> a fridge, of course. What we got in the fridge? We got anything in the fridge? And bacon, and bacon, of course, and Coca Cola, and and cheese, more cheese, 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 chocolate milk, and whatever this is. Biscuits. Biscuits. And um, coffee. All right. More chocolate milk. Let's keep moving. More coffee. Where else? What else we got? And Show us around. My mini fridge. It doesn't have a lot in it. Just Gatorade. All right. And the trash can. And the microwave. And there's a popcorn. And here's one of the bathrooms. Downstairs the bathroom. bathroom. Here we got Frank's room. Let's go into this is the like dining room. I always love furniture that has the uh, outlets and stuff built into them. That's cool. And here's my favorite spot. This is pretty comfortable actually. And this I like to do on this one. And this chair, it's re really, um, baby. It's really, really. And what's the best part? The best part is this. This is really comfortable, and I love it. It's so comfortable. All right, let's take them upstairs. And this big chair and the TV. Okay. Now upstairs. 
Alright, get out. And what else we got? We got a fireplace. Uh, yeah, a fireplace, a, a TV, which costs fifteen dollars for some reason. <laughs> Alright. We got a futon. Nice little chair. And then the best thing. Is of course there's a bathroom. Is in her sinks, toilet, bathroom, Ooh, shower. I don't know, it's locked. All right. Well, that's our little tour of the uh, of the Airbnb. Um, so yeah, next thing I'm gonna show you guys will be uh, in the morning when we start uh, kind of just going over my car and making sure it's all good before we head to the track. Loading is at uh, 1 p.m. So. Uh, we should be able to get up and get some stuff done before we head out. So. Wait, we have two more rooms here. Oh. Probably going to be AJ's room or Canva's. And this one. And that's the other one. Also a bathroom right here. I haven't saw this one yet. Oh. I have it. This is probably the nicest one. Like I said, so uh, yeah, in the morning we'll... Probably do a little bit of wrenching before we head to the track. <laughs> all right, good morning, guys. And I guess it wouldn't be an MTV Cribs episode with me showing you all my cars, right? First, we got my, uh, you know, my Turbo S197 drift car. This 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 thing's badass. It got the got got the hood vent, shooting out the hood, flames, all that jazz. That's what it's made for. Thanks, sick. And then we come over here, we got my, uh, my, my simple seat time Mustang, my other S197. That's mean, right? Yeah. And we got the daily. And then it's my, uh, you know, my 2015 Chevy Silverado 2500. Think sick. My other truck, just because. 1500. And then my baby here. And then everybody has to have a uh, right-hand drive JDM Legend, right? So my R32 drift car, and then my good old Tundra. But yeah, that's been uh, MTV Cribs. You guys can get out of here now. All right, so it's uh, actually day one for No Star Bash. Everybody is uh, getting their car loaded up. Um, Micah had some last minute shit that he had to do, but we're all good now, and uh, yeah, we're about to head in, load in, and uh, get pitted, get unloaded, get all the canopies and everything up, and then uh, I'll pick up from there. That was a last-minute Mustang rebuild for Micah. No cap. I wish I, I hope I got uh, at least some of the stuff that he did, because uh, he was working on it until like 3 in the morning last night, got up in the morning, and was working on it for like two hours, so yeah. But it's here. Look at it. Micah, your car's all ready, man? Yo, yep. Hell yeah. Got load up. How many hours you got into it from last night to this morning? Uh, five. Five hours. Yeah, this man was hustling last night, but she's on the trailer, so she's ready to party for sure. Sounds mean. Frank. Got Camba. Car's all loaded. He just got a new trailer. How did it tow? It towed well. Get your trailer from Lemons LLC in I think. I might have to check that place out because your boy needs a trailer. Hell, I guess your boy needs a truck as well, <laughs> like to be serious. But uh, yeah, I got a truck we may have to talk. But I just heard how much you struggled uh, getting here on it. But uh, yeah, like I said, we're gonna head out.
All right, well, we're all loaded in. All the cars are checked. We're all in the same group this time. We're all in group B. So uh, first session's group A, and then it's uh, us. So we still got an hour. Uh, me and the boys are going to head up to the uh, driver's meet and uh, figure out what layout we're doing and all that stuff and just, you know, get all the rules, etc. And then come back, chill for a little minute until it's our turn, and we'll be out ripping. But yeah, we got all the cars all unloaded. My car, Canva's, Micah's, Frank's, Jake's, Mike's, and then everybody else. This, this place is packed. But uh, yeah, heading up to the um, driver's meet. <laughs> just gonna take it easy just do uh, at least like a couple solo laps and then hopefully we can just jump right into some tandem because uh, that's what we want to see right talk about this uh, after this but as you notice I dipped a little inside and hit that ditch there uh, splash mud all over the side of my car but it didn't do any damage to anything but uh, right after this I actually pulled off and addressed it sessions out the way me and the boys got all the uh, cobwebs shaken out and all good um, 
You guys just probably saw a couple party laps. Shit was fun. Right now, we're just gonna probably walk around. I might uh, get some of uh, just the cars just in the pits and everything, and uh, we're gonna get some food and chill out before it's uh, time for us to go back out for our uh, second session for tonight. I, we only got one more, and then uh, that's it for today, and, and uh, we'll pick it back up tomorrow. So, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna walk around the pits for a little bit and uh, some more track stuff later. Well, when you're a kill care, you gotta make sure you get yourself uh, one of the track pizzas, so. Just ordered one and um, what's that again? A pupusa? A pupusa from the taco truck. Kai's over here jumping. jumping. <laughs> Corey's over here ordering pizza, <laughs> looking like she's getting burnt. But yeah, so we're gonna finish uh, eat some food. Like I said, I'm gonna try to go walk and get some more clips of some cars. I've been doing a horrible job at uh, filming the pit, so yeah.
guys and just like that we're gonna uh end it just got some laughs with the homie camba uh they were solid Thanks so again, man. That yeah. helped a lot. no problem man sometimes let, uh let me know what you guys think of those laughs you should comment in drew's comment section let, let me know appreciate it man but uh yeah so we, we just got some solid laughs me and the homie and uh yeah it's been a good first day uh i can't complain i feel like for a first day we were all i feel like we got pretty dialed pretty quickly honestly we need to take it easy and Kind of not. Right. Uh, I think we all did really good. Yeah, we were all talking about uh, basically skipping, uh, just only doing the first session today and not doing uh, the two sessions, but we got addicted and uh, me and the homie had to finish it out. Uh, Frank was sadly having some troubles with uh, his like motor issues again, like the car cutting out. So sadly he called it early. Uh, I think Micah actually has some kind of uh, I think he has to remove his oil cooler because it's like restricting uh, something and causing like low oil pressure or some shit. But uh, either way, like I said, solid laps, fun day, and uh, I mean that's a wrap for the first one. Uh, stay tuned because we'll have uh, day two and three from wrap those together. But those are usually the uh, crazy days. Tomorrow is also the car show, so I'll get some clips there. But uh, fuck yeah. <laughs>